Let's go! What's up, guys? I'm DK Wrestler, and in today's video, we're going to be opening up packs of the Hanna-Barbera Funko Series 2 NFTs. So let's get right to it. So, of course, like usual, before any pack opening i like to look at what the different redeemables are as terms to the nft drops so of course the first one we're going to be looking at here is the grail 999 pieces with a 0.27 percent chance of obtaining which is of course of huckleberry hound with the banjo of course if you had seen our recent video talking about what i liked either series two or series one of the Hanna barbera nfts i would have already went into description of about these pops but if you're new here here's a little bit of description i do like the overall uh pop here of huckleberry hound more than the series one i think it's pretty decent and then we have ourselves birdman the first of three legendary pops which all of the legendary pops are going to be talking about will be limited to 2000 pieces with a 1.64 percent chance of obtaining this one being birdman and this one might actually be my favorite pop from the redeemables here for series two of Hanna barbera really cool looking pop even though i have really no insight or any idea of what this character is or where it's from but i think it's still looking pretty cool and then we got ourselves mighty mitor which i'm assuming is from the same like show or franchise as the birdman and then we got ourselves mr jinx with dixie and pixie from huckleberry hound which is pretty cool you got more of a pop and buddies instead of a pop and buddy because it's holding two characters which those two characters already have funko pops and then we got ourselves the freddy funko as letterman as they're calling it for the royalty pop when of course you get the common uncommon rare and epic cards which is limited to 2300 pieces which this one's a little meh i think there are definitely better freddy funko pops for the royalty set so for today's drop i was able to get in pretty decently quick i think i had two different times of i think it's 11 minutes and 14 the standard packs did sell out by the time i got these premiums but regardless i was getting two premium packs for today's video which I'm very excited for this and hopefully we do pull some redeemables because we have a new streak of two videos in a row now where we did not get any redeemables so will it be a continuation of me not getting redeemables or will that streak be broken and we will finally get redeemables again being pulled in these packs so let's open up the first pack right here we'll open up obviously the uh more or not the more limited the less limited pack i guess of 16,828 so let's see what we got inside of here okay so i was expecting some cool little music going on but i do like the art on the back of the cards here where you do have the flintstones which funko why haven't you done a flintstones nft set maybe that's something in the near future of why they haven't even been featured in Hanna barbera but we'll reveal the first card here and it is a rare top cat not bad to have a rare as the first card we got a common mighty mitor not the redeemable because that would be a legendary card but that is a sneak peek of what it would look like. A rare Penelope Pit Stop. That looks pretty decent with the art form. An uncommon Birdman, once again, uh, Birdman being one of the redeemables, but this isn't the legendary card, so of course it's not the redeemable. Uncommon Huckleberry Hound. Once again, this is the same Huckleberry Hound that would be the redeemable for the Grail, but it's not. It's an uncommon, especially the card being black and white. And then here we go again. Jinx with Pixie and Dixie. Like that's once again another redeemable, except it is the uncommon card, so it's not the redeemable. Next up, we have a common Mor Morico Mole, an uncommon Tom an uncommon huckleberry hound we already got that card a common freddy funko as letterman which of course a lot of these uncommon and common cards we are getting are good if you're trying to get that royalty set completed but regardless i'm not going to be getting the royalty set completed for this one there we go baby let's go let's go redeemables yes all right victory lap 
a few moments later. <laughs> yes! Let's go! Let's go! We got ourselves a redeemable Mr. Jinx with Pixie and Dixie, number 383 out of 2000. The streak is back on. We're getting redeemables. Let's go. And this is a really awesome one where you get a lot of bang for your buck because there is pretty much three characters. And I do like the card art here where it is Pixie and Dixie getting chased around. Uh, that's pretty cool, but we still have some cards left in this pack. Maybe we'll get back-to-back -back redeemables. I mean, we have done that in a video previously, so let's see what the next card is. Oh, that... It had me the way that it was like very slow. I thought we had gotten another Legendary or the Grail. So it's a rare Mighty Mitor. A rare Mr. Jinx with Pixie and Dixie common birdman and then the last card being freddy funko uncommon and there's no series coin because we don't see a reveal next or it didn't kick off at the beginning so let's review everything including a redeemable pop let's go so we started off with a rare then we got a common a rare three uncommons a common two uncommons a common and then in the spot where obviously this video is covering there is the card of the legendary mr jinx with pixie and dixie uh which is pretty sweet i'm glad that it was this card that i ended up getting it would have been this or birdman that i would have been happy with but who knows we still have one more pack to go which also there are two rares in a row a common and an uncommon uh that basically we have one more pack to go we might get another legendary we might get a grail who knows so let's exit out of here and load up that last card 7761 out of 18250 that's right there were 18250 packs for both standards and premiums a little bit more actually than the original set of Hanna-Barbera NFTs, but man, let's open up this last pack. Could we get some extra last pack magic with another redeemable of sorts? Hopefully it's Birdman if it's anything. I mean, the Grail, okay, yeah, Grail would be cool, but I would like to see Birdman being pulled in this pack. So let's open this up. All right, let's reveal what the first card, or it could be the series coin, will be. It is a common Professor Pat Pending, which I believe was made into a pop previously. I think it was a New York Comic Con exclusive. I can't remember what year, 2019, I think. Oh, let's go! Let's go! A redeemable again! And it's Mr. Jinx with Pixie and Dixie let's go oh yeah we got a legendary it's the same one but we got another legendary of course this makes up for you know previous videos that we did not get a redeemable for this is great and i mean with uh selling some of the legendary items on atomic hub this will definitely go towards uh getting some of those nickelodeon packs because i do plan on trying to get that royalty set completed so i want to buy some packs uh, in order to complete the royalty or just buying the cards outright like the epics that I still need. So we still have, of course, this was two cards out of 15 or possibly 16 if you got the series coin or the one of one card. But we got 13 to go after this. So let's see what we got. Uncommon Birdman. Common Squiddly Diddly, which it's cool to see Squiddly Diddly. I mean, they had the soda recently, and it's been a while since a pop has came out. An Uncommon Big Gruesome, which... Did they do a pop of Big Gruesome? I think they might have. I just don't really remember it all that much. A Common Secret Squirrel. An Uncommon Big Gruesome. I believe that was literally the same card we got from uh, two cards ago in this pack. A common Morco Mole, which I believe we got that in the last pack that we had opened up. An uncommon Huckleberry Hound. And wait, is that 
That's Brian Mariotti. What a f***ing mark. He added himself in one of the cards. Oh my God, what is going on here? <laughs> oh, Brian, Brian. You had to add yourself in with the Huckleberry Hound, right? <laughs> uh, common Jerry. Uncommon Professor Pat pending, but I believe this is a different style art than what we had that basically kicked off this certain pack. Common Birdman thought it was the legendary that we were pulling, but it's still cool to see some of those commons. Uncommon Birdman, so the first one was a common. Maybe the next few cards is going to be a rare and an epic Birdman, and then maybe a legendary. Who knows? Common Benny the Ball. Did they make a pop of this? I don't remember, actually. I don't think they have, because I would have recognized it. I know Pat Pending, we'd gotten, obviously, Tom and Jerry, uh, but I don't know if they made a pop of this. But we do have what looks to be one card left behind here, unless, of course, there is the series coin or the one of one coin that will say reveal next after this. So let's see what we got. Epic, Roughness, Rough Cut, and Sawtooth, which I think for sure this definitely has not been made into a pop. I could be wrong, but I do not recognize this at all. So let's view everything in this pack. So we kicked off with a common Professor Pat pending. And then the second card was another legendary Mr. Jinx with Pixie and Dixie. Then we got an uncommon, common, uncommon, common, Uncommon, common, uncommon, common, uncommon, common, uncommon, common, and then epic. Lots of back and forth uncommons and commons, and then ending off with an epic, but with a legendary, which is insane. Holy crap. Let's review everything that we had gotten here between the two packs we opened up here. Okay, so within these packs, we have ourselves no royalty set. We obviously didn't complete it. Usually you wouldn't be able to really complete the set all that much with only two packs, but we obtained two legendaries, which I believe it's been a while actually since we've gotten two legendaries in one of these videos and then no grail and you got to collect it by July 26, 2023. But for the royalty set, we did get 24.44% of it completed with nine out of 35 of the commons. Mind you, there were some duplicates for sure. Eight out of 25 of the uncommons four out of 18 of the rares and then only one out of 12 of the epics and of course for the redeemables wise we did not get the grail huckleberry hound we did not get the legendary birdman which would have been cool to pull we did not get the legendary mighty mitor but we did get two two of the Mr. Jinx with Pixie and Dixie legendary pops, which was really cool to actually pull two redeemables. Even though it was the same one, it would have been cool to get different, but still cool to get a couple of redeemables from this drop. And of course, if you enjoyed this Funko NFT drop, definitely like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know if you got any packs. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. One, two, three, I'm out of here.